De tweedaagse workshop Flood Risk Management, die het ministerie van Openbare Werken, Transport en Communicatie heeft georganiseerd, is vanmorgen afgesloten. Op de tweede dag is voornamelijk gediscussieerd over de kustbescherming van ons land, waarbij gebruik is gemaakt van de analyses en studies over dit onderwerp. Volgens Matt Elliott, senior consultant kustbescherming voor de Wereldbank, is er een verschil tussen het voor- en het nadammen van de kust. Based on the information we had about the flood levels beforehand, it is likely that the level of flooding was higher, but it was freshwater flooding previously, than the subsequent, um, subsequent flood risk. What we have seen though, is that that change, that mean sea level change, is probably the key factor that's increasing the flood risk. So the drop between pre-damming and post-damming was approximately, on an annual basis, was approximately, if I got it right, 200 to 300 mil lower once dammed on a regular basis. So they, the low level and the high level have actually come down from what it was previously. Even though flow, the difference between having a tidal flow and having some some water pushing against it creates a reduction. The actual incidence of no longer having the freshwater floods will have reduced the actual total flood levels. Er is gebrainstormd over de huidige afvoersysteem van de kanalen die naar de Suriname rivier stromen. Elliot geeft onder meer aan wat de voordelen zijn van de mangrove bossen aan de kust. From a direct perspective from the coastal stability side of things, it is better not to go directly to the mudflat area or to the coast. Uh, the use of, the advantage of having a mangrove fringe th along the coast is actually that you can have a degree of freshwater storage area behind the mangrove. So that has a far more positive effect and you could use that in terms of local drainage but putting a drain directly to the north and to the coast has fairly massive problems both with regards to coastal stability and the potential for sedimentation and the level of management of a drain that went straight north. So there's kind of a mix of yes and no but there is local storage which yes, the, yes you want to go north but overall large-scale area storage, no, you don't want to use that as a pathway. Met Elliot, consultant voor de Wereldbank, heeft de resultaten van het onderzoek naar de kustbescherming in ons land gepresenteerd bij de afsluiting van de workshop Flood Risk Management. De duwedaagse workshop is in Hotel Torarica gehouden.